Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you my three favorite tools for creating QR codes quickly and easily. Let's go ahead and take a look here. Let's say you found a great web page like this one here that has my ebook 50 Tech Tuesday tips, or you've got your Google form that you want to make easily accessible to your students. If you're using Google Chrome, a really easy way to generate a QR code is to simply click on the little share this page button and you will find a QR code right there that you can download and put wherever you would like. Alternatively, you can right click on the page and select create QR code for this page. And it does the exact same thing. Now, Another tool that I really like for creating QR codes is this one called qrtune.com. And let's go ahead and take a look at it right here. So let's say we have this page and I want to create a QR code for it. Well, let's just paste that link in, click next. And now you can select a photograph to be the center of your QR code. I'm gonna select a photograph right now of myself and we'll use that one as the center of my QR code. So I have a bunch of selfies of myself and let's go ahead and add that in to the QR code. And like it says, it's gonna be a cartoonized version of myself at the center of that QR code. And so there I am now at the center of that QR code and it actually works. And as you can see, you can just click that download button and then you have a copy of it. Now, a third option is QR code monkey. And this one has the most options for customizing your QR codes of any of the three here. And again, let's go ahead and take this link and we're going to put that link right in there. And you can then change the colors. So you can change the color scheme here. Just click and move it around. Let's say we want to make it kind of a shade of green. We can use that. And our background color, we can make reddish if we wanted to. You can add a logo or add an image if you want. Okay. And you can see right here, it's saying, oh, we recommend giving using more contrast. Okay, that's not dark enough. So let's put it back there. Make it really dark again. Okay. And we can, again, add our logo image here. Okay. Want to upload a logo? Great, you can. Otherwise, leave it as is. You can use this option to customize the design of it. So we want to frame it up a little bit. Let's use that little frame. And now let's create that QR code. And so there's our new QR code design. You can see here, you can change the size of it. Let's make it a little lower quality, create that QR code. And then you can download that as an image file for your customized QR code using qrcodemonkey.com. You'll notice I use the URL option, but you could also simply put in a chunk of text. This is a sample piece of text. And then we'll create a QR code and we'll change the colors again. Let's change out that color scheme. I want to use blue here. So I'll use that blue, create that QR code. Now I have that blue color scheme for my QR code. And when it's scanned, all that will appear on the person's phone is this is a sample piece of text. You can do that for all these other options that you see up here. Even a great way to give out the information for connecting to the Wi-Fi network in your school, in your house, or elsewhere. So those are my three favorite tools for creating QR codes quickly and easily. As always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.